In ProPresenter 4, you could change the hue, saturation, contrast, and brightness of video clips. Now in Pro 5, you can apply video effects. So let's go down to our video and image bin. And down here you'll see actually all of the free media that you get with ProPresenter 5. So these are from some awesome artists. This is a great way to build up your media library. Now to apply an effect, I'm gonna right click on a piece of footage. I'm gonna to go to Media Properties. Now in here you'll see hue, saturation, contrast, and brightness that we're used to, but also we now have a drop down with new effects we can apply. So let's check out color filter here which allows us to go and recolorize our footage. We can also go to uh, sepia tone, we have a color invert, we have a gray invert, and we have a heat signature. Well, let's go back to our color filter. And we can actually play and watch this live. There's no rendering needed. And now we can add an image blur. This is actually gonna blur out the image. And again, there's no rendering. This is all done live. We can also go down and do an edge blur, which just blurs the edges of the image. So you can see here, we're getting a nice subtle blurred vignette to the footage. And then we could go maybe uh, kick up the saturation a little bit, kick up the contrast, take down the brightness. And we now have a totally new piece of footage that we can use in our media library. So those new video effects allow you to take the media that you purchased and use it to its fullest.